Everybody. Welcome to 5 Day. This is a new segment that I want to start on the channel where basically every Friday I'll make a 5 minute video just talking about the little things that I kind of want to talk about. It doesn't have to be anything specific really, it's just whatever is on my mind for the week. It could be a tutorial, it could be something about philosophy, it's really any anything that I have on my mind. So let's not waste any more time because now I'm on the clock and you guys got to watch me eating noodles. Let's talk about exposition. Exposition is a storytelling device where you talk about something that happened before the story is actually happening. It gives context to the story and it makes your characters feel more fleshed out. Too bad in a ton of movies, exposition is done horribly. This is Katana. She's got my back. She can cut all you in half with one sword stroke, just like mowing the lawn. I would advise not getting killed by her. Her sword traps the souls of its victims. I'm a soldier, and you're a serial killer who takes credit cards. When the shooting starts, and it will, you'll cut and run. So if you're making a short film, you can make exposition really fast by showing and not telling. This is something that's universal throughout all movie making, but you should show and not tell. We have a movie for a reason. What you want to do is show people stuff through the movie. You have video. Use it. Because if you're just going to say everything through dialogue or narration, then just write a book. A really, really great thing that I saw in the Wonder Woman film with Gal Gadot is a scene whenever they're training. At the very beginning, whenever little baby Wonder Woman is looking at all of the Amazons training, there is this huge lady who's standing up on this, like, board, I guess, fighting this other woman. And then someone hits her in the back with a staff, and she doesn't even, like, flinch. And she just turns around and she grabs the lady and just, like, throws her. Now that is spectacularly well done. That is exposition. I don't need to know that that lady is super strong. You don't need to have a conversation where you're like, oh yeah, that lady, she's like the strongest of all of the Amazon. I don't need to know that. Another really great example of exposition is the character introduction of Indiana Jones in Raiders of the Lost Ark. Now, Indiana Jones is still one of my favorite characters of all time, but I just wanna say his intro is probably one of the best ones in cinema history. You see all kinds of stuff. You see his gun in his pocket, you see his whip come out and he hits the gun away from the guy. You see his hat, you see everything on him except for his face. And you learn all about this guy just through that. No dialogue necessary, you learn everything you need just through the movements of the camera around this guy. That's really well done. Some of the best examples of exposition, The Matrix. Whenever Morpheus is sitting down with Neo to talk about the Matrix, he says, The Matrix is everywhere. It is all around us. Even now, in this very room. You can see it when you look out your window, or when you turn on your television. Yeah, that, that is spectacularly well done. 
it's good enough that you can look at it and you feel enveloped into the exposition. You want to hear more about it. You want to hear him explain it. That's well done. But there's also really bad examples. Everyone who knows me knows I love the Star Wars movies. But come on. Bad exposition? Master Qui-Gon, Yoda was telling me about midichlorians. What's a midichlorian? Well, Anakin, I'm glad you asked. And if you've never seen it, here's the scene. It's almost identical to that. Master, sir, I heard Yoda talking about midichlorians. I've been wondering, what are midichlorians? Midichlorians are a microscopic life form that resides within all living cells. And we are symbionts with them. Without the midichlorians, life could not exist. And we would have no knowledge of the Force. It's, it's a train wreck. So that was about five minutes of me talking about exposition. I hope to do a lot more of these because I think they're going to be really fun. And I will see you all next time. Also, before I forget, like, subscribe, make sure to share the videos, make sure to share all of my videos. There's a lot of really big new things that are going to be happening on this channel in the next probably four or five weeks. So be excited, be ready. It's going to be awesome. And I will see you guys all next time. Have a good one.